Hey, hi, uh, this is Arun Aptiwari and uh, I, as I said, you know, I have an overall experience of five years with the telecom domain and I have been working for NMS and EMS systems. In the past, I have worked for uh, two of the major clients with telecom and currently I am a part of service assurance team. So basically, it deals with how the product is being given to the customer and how you know we assure the client so service assurance basically comes into picture when the product is delivered now service assurance has various modules one of them being network management system and netcool omnibus and other modules are a part of it well basically service assurance has many of your modules like fault management incident management network management usage billing management workforce management so there are like many components of service assurance specifically fault and network management systems they basically deal with devices and alarms in the network and netcool basically being a network management system deals with the network and so let me give you a brief overview of how it works okay so in the three or four lectures which we i have covered in this this tutorial we are going to cover how this application works and how it collects information from the network and it consolidates it analyze it and then makes a report and gives a, a consolidated view to the NOC, which is the network operation center so let's uh, start with the first module uh, with the prerequisite to the course so um, the, the the targeted audience should be able to use unix linux command line instructions because we are going to use unix very often so the next thing is an understanding of database and sql advantages as well uh, the next thing which uh, i would recommend is a understanding of basic programming constructs and scripting language because at some point of time we need to write rules because what happens is let's suppose I have an ex customer he comes to me saying that you know I need this product and I don't need the basic net cool rules I want you to modify it then what we need to do is we need to modify the rules file with whatever our clients ask for so that is just a basic example of how we are going to do some scripting as well going forward um, you know um, i would recommend that the targeted audience should also have an understanding of network management which is like how network works and you know the basic protocols the ports and all so um, let's start with the code course outline and let me tell you what all uh, we are going to cover in this uh, netcool omnibus module lecture so um, starting with installation of how the application is installed how the desktop works what is the role of conductor how event list comes into picture because this is the uh, you know the application is uh, which NOC uses so event list basically shows you the alarms which are customized based on the client as i discussed before the event list basically is going to show you all the events based on the priorities based on severity and whatever information my client wants so next is sub event list which will really include filters and views and then we will come to the major part which is the object server which is like the heart of this application so we'll be covering configuration and how queries are made how we take care of the admin part assigning users assigning groups how to take care of the automation and how triggers how procedures are written going to the next thing will be databases and tables how that is being set up in uh, the later half of the second module we'll be covering probes which is again a very important part of netcool application so this probe basically collects the information from the network devices and then passes it to the object server with its customization that we will discuss in the next modules next we have our the rule file and the props file which is the property file of this application probe 
of the component probe sorry next we will be checking more of object server how what all the properties it has what are the major properties object server holds which makes netcool so special going forward we have a process control agents which are called PA agents and then the overall architecture we're going to cover let's proceed to the next one next slide which talks about the netcool NMS application so if you see my screen it's an advanced network management system where we provide the user better solution so that they can view alarm and consolidate the older homegrown applications which major of the telecom clients have they don't have these features which netcool offers so that is the reason it has been it is being widely used now a netcool is uh, an uh, alarm fault management system which is used to monitor alarms from the network elements and devices so as i said we have the first layer which is the network and then we have nms ems layer which is responsible to collect the information from the devices and then it passes on this information to the next layer which is sms also known as service management layer and then going forward we have the business so you know the major components uh, layer wise if you see starts from business management layer then we have the service management then we have the nms ems layer and then we have the major network so netcool works on the second layer in this model so now how what it does so it's like netcool collect and consolidates even information from different network data and it presents a simplified view of this information to the operators and the NOC, which is a network operation center now it what it does it you know if i have a specific client which only needs a specific device information then netcool is the solution it presents information based on the interest of the specific users through individual configurable filters and views so this configuration and how views and filters are made we're going to cover in the next lectures it also performs intelligent on managed alerts like deduplication and correlation you know these are the the features of netcool which makes it so special and whatever alarm it sends will be viewed by the network operation center it maintains a sybase or a db which depends on the vendor and it uh, the netcool major component which is an object server collects all the information and stores it in form of memory so this is just a basic and you know i'm going to cover more about netcool in the coming lectures how it works and how the properties are defined what all are the unique keys and everything will be covered in the next coming lectures let's talk about uh, the netcool architecture how netcool is designed and how other applications are integrated how gateways are used to integrate the application with different other applications like clarify remedy so that ticketing can be done so let's start talk about the heart of netcool application which is object server and if you see the graph the image sorry there is a netcool reporter which is attached to object server which is like where my business my client sits and he basically asks me to give him a consolidated report of how much alarm and what is the severity in overall report so that is being used by the client so the other the, the image next to it is desktop which shows a simplified view of the object of the of the alarms based on the client and the knock next we have web top which we are going to discuss in more details in the coming lectures we have netcool impact which have which uses ipl which is called impact language which is again a very useful tool then we have precision which does the network discovery and we have netcool visionary then of course we have the probes which are being connected to the network devices as i said we have a network layer and nms is a network facing application which faces all the network elements now the network elements can be of different types it can be cisco it can be alcatel it can be leucent so there are many um, you know devices in the network so probes are responsible to 
take the information from these devices and consolidate and send it to object server in a form my client wants. So how the changes are done, how we customize it, we will discuss for sure in the coming lectures. Then we have simple products like Netcool, Firewall, ISM, and TSM Infusion, which we will discuss how you know they're integrated and you know how object server takes information from them. Moving to the next slide, which is it talks about Netcool model. So if you see, we have uh, like five you know major components. The first one being manage entity, second is collect, then consolidate, analyze, and inform. So Netcool model basically does all these things. And if you see the screen, I have the base layer, which is where we have the physical plan, transmission layer, network layer, and the application layer. The first block talks about omnibus, which is real-time historical and performance events so this is basically we what we are discussing in this uh, lecture will be omnibus which does real time you know takes the event it has a historical event and it stores in in the, his db which is called object server which already has a memory db now they are probes and monitors which collects the information similarly on the right hand side if you see there is a application called precision which does an asset inventory so when I say asset inventory it's like uh, I have a new device in place and it, it does a dynamic topology and it configures that particular device it identifies it so basically used for network identification it has this auto discovery in place and it identifies the device in the network now coming to impact and let's see what it does but before it let me tell you how you know what is the major features of omnibus and precision so they basically come under the part of collect and consolidate so you know they collect information from uh, these uh, devices and then it consolidates the information whatever information they have next one being back which does a correlation you know it joins it does intelligence things and then Next is the report, which kind of falls in the dashboard. This is like the overall module structure of Netcool. We'll be surely discussing more in detail in the coming lectures. Thank you.